We left Florida a couple of days ago and are now in Georgia, but we have not stopped hearing Teddy complain about his need to rant and tell you all his, his so-called quote-unquote horrible experience, right, Teddy? Yeah, it's, uh, <laughs> back in Florida, I, I had a... I had a traumatic experience in Florida. Well, we were at a gas station a couple of days ago, and Teddy just started to rant and rave, and I filmed him doing it. Because, let me, I wanted to give you the back experience and tell the other side of it, because, you know, he's kind of got the one side poor thing. We never abused him, of course. Muffet, all right, Teddy has to be behind a gate when we're in Miami. Why, Teddy? because there's a horrible dog that has caused me great injury and harm when I've been there. His past experience with Gizzy, the pug, Sarah's dog, has Gizzy not... The, Gizzy, the, Gizzy, Gizzy the pug is correct. ...has not been good. He's not had a very good experience. And so we protected him. We were protecting you. And we had him on in another room behind a gate, right? Well, Muffet was with him, but Muffet is skinny enough, look at her little body, that she was able to squeeze through and be with us. But poor Teddy, we were protecting you, right? We were protecting you. Anyway. I felt he, abandoned. <laughs> anyway, poor thing, he's with us now. He needed the, his, he had a need to rant and rave and let the whole world know his side. So you're gonna see it right now. Hey Teddy, hey Muffet. Okay, so we're on the road again. I know that you guys are thrilled because tell everybody what your experience was like in Miami. What was your experience like, Teddy? Sure, what? Can you tell that I'm sad? <laughs> You're sad to well, leave? No, no, it's when I can stress. Can you can you notice know, like, I'm so stressed out? Listen. Yes. But, why why wait, were you listen? <laughs> Why were you so stressed? Tell everybody about your experience in Miami. What? Well, what? you see, I'm still stressed out. I need a Valium. No, you don't take drugs, no, 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 Teddy. I don't take drugs. Well, it's just because of Gizzy. What happened? I have, I have a traumatic experience of last year when, when Gizzy, for no reason, came and started to bite me. She Oh, I know. She had your head in her mouth, right? attacked me. It was dramatic. I had to fast and pray for you know, 40 days. <laughs> so every single time that I see Gizzy, it becomes a trauma. So you so, can see we left Gizzy, but you can see I was still kind of traumatized. Can you tell? Yes, poor thing. And and you were, poor thing, you were kind of ostracized this time, well, right? Well, what happened was they... They had to, uh, they had to separate me. Okay, you see, I'm so stressed out. Can you tell? I know, they had to separate, oh, Teddy. So they had to separate you and, and you I were kind separated. of in jail, right? I, I was in the, I was in the, uh, the Raul dog jail for like two weeks because they had to separate me like in a separate room because Gizzy would not, Gizzy could not have a chance to attack me. So you see, it's going to take me about two hours to finally calm down. And Muffet was skiddy enough that she got through the bars, right? And also, yeah. Gizzy doesn't attack her for some reason. Well, it's because you provoked him for so many years, right? Well, anyways, I'm very happy to be away from Gizzy. And I'll be calm like in a few hours' time. Okay. And for all my viewers, for my 2.5 million followers. <laughs> Teddy. Rest assured that I'll be back to normal soon. Okay. Well, tell everybody bye for now. Bye. <laughs> bye.